Hey Gearheads, this is JJ uh, from Gear Report and we're over here at Adapted Tacticals booth over in the NRA 2016 meet and exhibit show. And uh, we're here with Gary and uh, as you guys know, we're gonna start uh, showcasing uh, some of the products that uh, are customized for the 1022. It's gonna be a running series of reviews about the different products. And uh, they have a couple of products for the 1022 that I think that you guys are gonna be uh, interested in knowing about. So, Gary, what can you show us? Great, thanks JJ. Appreciate you guys stopping by. Um, we got a whole new line of barrels. Uh, we call them our Tack Hammer barrels. Tack Hammer barrels are brand new on the market. They just came out this year at SHOT Show. Um, so, we have a couple different varieties. We have the shorter charger barrels that we have a set up for. We also have your longer, your takedown, and your full length uh, standard uh, barrels. So, the Tack Hammer barrels, basically what we tried to do is, we took, and you can look in the package here, but we necked down the steel barrel, so you took a bull barrel and necked it down as much as we could and stepped it down, but still kept you uh, a good solid steel barrel in the middle, so you don't have an insert or anything like you do on some of the lightweight barrels. Okay. So it's stepped down, and then we, we include aluminum Cerakoted sheath that gives you that 0 0.920 diameter consistent throughout. This a nice look of a target for your yeah. rifle. Yeah, so it gives you that full dimension. We've cut the weight by about 40%, but you still have a real accurate hard steel core barrel. And then what we do on the uh, attack hammer is we include a uh, matching compensator, which you can take off and put a, a suppressor, suppressor on there, and then also a matching uh, cantilevered rail. So those are, you get them pink, red, and the coyote tan. Yeah. That's, that's one of the things that I've, I've very rarely seen. Um, a lot of the people complain that the 1022 is not as accurate because of the wedge that they use to clamp the barrel on, and so it can wiggle a little bit, and your sight, if, you, if you're using a scope, you're gonna be running your sights on the um, receiver itself. So that there can be a wiggle. So man, that's very, very interesting because that's gonna take care of it. Especially on the uh, takedowns, when you take the rifle apart repeatedly, yes. you're having to re-zero it if the optic's on the receiver. If you put the optic on a cantilevered rail, and then you go and put that take takedown together, it's zeroed on the forend portion. So that allows a little bit of stability and quickness to back to zero. So. Yeah. So that's user installable. You can put that at the house. Uh, you can go to a gunsmith if you want to, but it's all user installed. So, so how about the rifles? Yeah. Uh, nice thing is here's our here's our tack hammer barrel again, but we've installed it on our RM4 rifle stock. Um, the RM4 stock we make that we make everything in Boise, Idaho. So it's awesome. made, made in the U USA. Yeah, made in the USA. So uh, this stock's got a lot of great features to it. Um, a lot of people like the adjustability that's in the back of the stock. So it'll, it'll fit a lot of different shooters, whether it's your your son or daughter out there shooting, or your wife or a larger, taller guy. So that'll adjust with a simple, quick, quick, quick adjust in the back. Uh, you got the pistol grip for really good control. So that allows you to nice control, do stuff with your off hand, pick up stuff, and still maintain really good control uh, of the rifle. Nice thing features to have in the back as well, which is a unique feature at our stock, is you can store two extra factory 10 round mags in the back. So if you're out there shooting, drop one mag, put another mag in, and you're ready to go. So also the barrel channel, which you can see our tack hammer barrel here. The barrel channel actually has a patented removable channel. You can use a bull barrel or you can use a factory standard barrel. Yeah. And one last really neat feature is a, a flip-flop rail. The rail actually will flip out and be exposed. So you can put different rail-mounted accessories on there, or you can flip it over and hide it back inside so it's nice and smooth, so you don't have your a rough rough uh, texture on your hand and shooting and stuff. So yeah, that's so awesome. that's that's a complete stock that comes in popular colors like cryptic. Uh, we have our stone camouflage that we've we patented. Uh, Money girl, different different camo patterns, or you can just get it in black. So, and this is available for a standard stock, and then also the takedown. We have a takedown version. So, yeah, and I see your version over here of the charger. Yeah, and uh, that one is on the takedown also, right? Yeah. So this is a new product from from Ruger, of course, uh, the takedown charger. So what we did is uh, gave it a little more um, features. We have a sling swivel here in the back, so you can actually connect a sling to it. There again, you got that nice pistol grip on there. Again, you have a, a nice uh, 
ergonomic foregrip with a stud on it. You can put your bipod on there, but it's also compatible with our takedown, takedown, and then also our tack hammer barrel. So you can see that it's a complete package. Looks really great. What can you tell me about that grip? It looks different. Yeah, it's definitely different. Um, this is a patented product we came out with. It's a monopod. It kicks out of the grip. So if I'm shooting, let's say, off the hood of a truck and I don't have a bipod on the front, I can put it down. Put it down, put this on the hood of the truck, and we're having a forearm, forearm up, or it sits like a tripod. Nice and nice and level. So a lot of good features on there. So, okay, well, so you know, all the cool products that you have, where can we find them? Uh, you can buy them directly from us, uh, adaptivetactical.com, or you can go to your local dealer or you can search online. A lot of good online dealers out there too. So Okay. Well guys, there you have it. Look forward to seeing this one's during the review yeah. series.